Welcome back to Pop-Up Tech Talks. We're here at VMworld US 2017. I have Howard with me today. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Howard Marks, Chief Scientist at Deep Storage LLC. I'm an independent analyst and run a test lab where I beat storage systems into submission. That sounds like an extremely fun job. So we were chatting a little bit earlier about exactly kind of the sausage and how the sausage is made, what goes into making a white paper from an analyst perspective. Please tell us more. Well, you know, for, for us, it starts with an idea. And I come up with a thought that, you know, maybe HCI makes sense for robos, but doesn't scale cost effectively. And then I do some rough numbers and figure out whether my idea has any weight. And then I talk to the companies that I'm friendly with and who where that idea supports their message and see if they want me to go and write up the details and think it through. But almost always for us, it's a matter of we have an idea and that resonates with a, some group of products where that idea could support their message. Um, some other folks will take an idea from the vendor and simply run with it. And as John Troyer has described, one of my erstwhile co-analysts, you know, they're willing to d describe the storage performance of a ham sandwich. And so, you know, we're both pay for play. Clearly, I get paid by vendors. That's how I make my money. But vendors pay me because I have the idea, I have a credible thought about it, sure. not just because I can tell, they can send the message out for them. Exactly, that's great. So it's great to see that in the behind the scenes where that all comes from um, and how your thought process is. It gives more credibility into the entire process, I think. It's not just you know being a corporate puppet, so to speak. So that, that's fantastic. Uh, one other quick question I want to ask of you before you go, a little off the wall. What are you more scared of, the zombie apocalypse or the AI robot uprising? Oh, definitely the AI robot uprising. I know how to deal with a zombie apocalypse. Zombies are easy. Chop the head off, zombie's dead. Okay. You know, I got, you know, great battle axes. We can deal with that. Skynet? Skynet's coming, and I'm afraid about Skynet. You know, it's true. Judgment Day, according to the movies, has gone by, but, you know, several times we've had Terminators come back, and it just moves the date. Eventually, we're going to have robot overlords, and this really bothers me. Okay. Well, I'm hoping we all outlive that date. <laughs> Thanks for being on the show. Thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe on YouTube, and we'll see you next time.